What's up guys, so welcome back to the camp. Um, anyway, so we are here, it is fall and Halloween is just around the corner. So we are going to be making us a Halloween wreath. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So we're gonna start with this. This is a 14 inch wreath um, circle thing that you're um, as you guys can tell by the title, this is all from Dollar Tree. So this is like very inexpensive. It cost $8. So um, we're using the little orange mesh that we got from the Dollar Tree, some black, and some purple. Okay, oh, and then we're going to be using light. I'm going, I got two of these. We might only need one, um, but I got two of them just in case. We're going to be wrapping it around it to give it some light. I also picked up these little ornaments. I didn't even notice that the ornaments, but they're ornaments. It says boo, and this one says eek. So that's our colors. It's the black, orange, and um, purple. And then also I'm going to go get a witch sign and attach it to that as well. But right now I'm going to go ahead and show you how to make the wreath. We're going to take this out and we're roughly going to do about four and a half to maybe five inches of it. We're just gonna kinda round it up to where it makes like a little tube so just kind of give it a little stuff it's kind of sticky just let you guys know it's my first time making this so you know what we're just gonna go ahead and cut it because this thing is not sticking <laughs> so about this length is good about this size probably about four and a half inches mm -hmm. Um, we just want to get it to roll up a little tube just like this. So we're going to do three of them and then we're going to bind them together. Oh yeah, and I forgot you guys need pipe cleaners. So let's go ahead and cut out some of these. I'm doing black just because you won't really be able to see it. And you can't see my head. You can see me? Okay. I'm going to cut these in half and you'll see why. Okay, and then now that way it's in a little tube. Of course, my battery's dying. Then you're going to take one of your pipe cleaners. You're going to just give it a little twist. Twist it really tight around it. Just like so, and it looks kind of funky right now, but that's okay. Then you're gonna take your wreath, you're gonna take the two center ones and just give it a little twist around. So that way you can secure it. You can also do like ribbon and add ribbon to it. I'll probably go back and add some ribbon. Just to make it kind of fun. And then we'll just continue. Okay, so I went ahead and made these up while my battery is charging. So we have tons of these. Here are the ones that I used with the ribbon. I added some ribbon to it to give it a little bit more of a look. There we go. So you can see the little ribbon that I added to it. It gives it a little colorful look to it. So then I have two here of the orange. I have one with the glittery ribbon and I'm not doing both of them because I don't want it overbearing. So we have the two orange, the purple, a black, and then we'll come back and we'll do two more of the orange. So one with the ribbon, one without. So I'm gonna go ahead and fasten those on and I'll show you what it looks like. All right, so here's how it looks on the back. And then here's the front so far. So you guys can just watch me as I put them on. Okay, so I finally got it to how I like it. Just kind of, I was just messing around with it. Oh, this is really overexposed. 
Um, I was just kind of messing around with it, trying to, try to get it to pop out. Um, I would advise you to probably use maybe a one inch um, ribbon, just because um, you can't really see it. That's okay. It still kind of gives you that little glitter in it. So now what we're going to do is I got these from Dollar Store. I'm always telling you about the witch. So I'm actually going to cut these in half. Or I'm going to cut this off. I also got this one here. And I'm going to use the center of it for in the center of the, um, the reef. Boots. Those are so cute. I think the boots are super cute. Okay. So now we need to get our handy dandy glue. So I'm going to use purple pipe cleaners only because I ran out of the black and I think the purple will just kind of um, blend in. I put quite a bit of glue right there on the, um, whoops, just right over the pipe cleaner. Okay, so we got them glued on there, like so. I put a lot of glue, this is how this middle one looks. I'm gonna place the, the little head, sorry you guys if this is really, um, you're just gonna come in here and you're gonna find the little, um, the wire, and you're just gonna wrap it around however you like it and then you can always cut these you know once you know how loose or how tight you need them fluff this back up have the top of the witch okay so we have our top on here now so now we're gonna go ahead and do the feet and the feet. And make sure you guys line them up too because you don't want them to be crooked. I think mine are crooked. Push behind it. All right, so you got your feet on and then your little hat on. So now we're gonna go in and do the center one. That's a lot of glue. Once you're done twisting it, just kinda work your other stuff through and there you go. You have your cute little leaf. That's super cute. <laughs> I like it. I really do. That's super cute. Dang. That came out really cute. Alright you guys, so there you go. You guys got your wreath. So you got your Dollar Tree wreath, your DIY, and it only costs about $7 for everything. All right, you guys, so there you go. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give me a like, subscribe, and comment down below. Let me know if you guys enjoyed it. If you guys wanna see any more videos like this, please comment down below, let me know, and we will see you on our next video. Bye, guys. Oops. That's super cute. That's super cool. That looks cute. That's only one and I bought two two to go around. <laughs>